I'm going to do is put a bunch of flat surfaces and a couple pockets and engrave on it. And then I'm going to do a full three axis mill moving X, Y, or X, Z, and A at one time. And actually, a spiral one. I'm going to go down to a smaller diameter. And then I'm going to wrap some words around the part this way and this way. And so the picture kind of shows what you're going to end up with here. So I've got six surfaces, as I said. I've got words on three of the surfaces, pockets on the other three surfaces. And then this is a, a helix type move. And then we're going to wrap words around the part as well. Right. Great. Okay. Um, for setup here, what we've changed is now you've got an A offset. And so A offset for a round part really doesn't come into play. But if you wrote, loaded a square part in there, and you wanted to get the top surface perfectly square with your, your axis, uh, you would put some angle distance in here. So in other words, you put the angle from the home of your indexer to the flat surface on your part. And so that would be the A offset you put in. As I said, for a round part, it really doesn't matter, so it's zero. And then the rest of the offsets are located just like they are on all the other machines. Okay. Can you run with the door open? Well, up here, obviously, here's your A axis. Okay, so that's going to count your angles as you move. It counts to 360 and then goes over to zero and wraps it in. I'm going to run with the door open because I've got a little jumper in there, so the chip shouldn't fly too far over it. And I've slowed everything. If I put the air on here, well, let's see what happens there.
really cool how this does this. That's what I'm doing. <laughs> All right, Leo, how'd it go? Oh, it went very well, as you can see. <laughs> My expert programming made this part come out just perfect. <laughs> Except for the little screw up here, I used too big of a tool. All right. Good work, guys. Can I comment for the record here? Pardon? Can I comment for the record? Do I have a comment for the record? Very impressive for the first shot.